Okay, gang, you know that I keep my edge comp here on the steering column just for the sake of this test. I went ahead and unplugged it under the hood and uh, took it out here. It's laying on my console. It's seen better days. And I've got the scan gauge set up to show map pressure. Let me see if I can set this up like I normally do. Let me tilt this critter. There we go. Now, as you can see, it's 28.3. Remember, there's no edge comp, no mods. I'm just solely on injectors now. so we can hear but as you can see there's a very big skew like I'm cruising right now at about three pounds of boost and I'm showing 32 on the gauge so I know that number is totally erroneous and like I said there's no other electronic mods on there so that's what the ECM is producing with just the sensor alone That's wide open stomped, 12, 15, 17, 20 pounds of boost doing 65 miles an hour, 21, 22, 70 miles an hour. So that's why I can provide you with the map pressure sender on the scan gauge. It's not an accurate number. It's not something that you can use. It's definitely skewed because here I am idling now and I'm back at 28.6. You've got to turn me around here. One more time up over hump. <sighs> Definitely the fuels without the box in place. It gets up around 23 pounds and dies on its face. No check engine lights without the box, so. Once again, I'm cruising about a pound and a half, doing six miles an hour. Give me a little bit, I'll get this uh, processed up and I'll get it on the internet for you guys to see.